All right, so here we go. The consensus, two best strawweights in the world. Meeting for a second time. Zhang Wei Li won the first matchup with Yolanda Yen Jacek early 2020 at UFC 248. But it was a close fight. Many thought they wanted one that night. Many thought Yen Jacek won that night. We'll see which fighter has made the adjustments in advance of this second half time. Great tempo to her striking game tonight. She is staying busy in a nice series of punches again there. She's in a great flow state. The hands are flowing, the head movement's going. She's doing a fantastic job. You love that flow state. I love it. Nice punch there by Yeong Jai Well, it's one thing to be confident in your chin. It's another thing to leave your head wide open for damage. And that's exactly what she did there as she eats the uppercut. Let's see if she circles out and tries to prevent any further damage here. Oh, head kick. Jacek's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swelling. So just over 20 total strikes, which have landed for Wei Li Zhang. Ooh, what a punch. Back and forth we go here. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Man, her striking looks clean tonight. Timing on point. Her timing's on point, her accuracy's on point. She's very busy, she's in a good flow. Well, she's already connected on a few hooks so far here in the round, and just as I say that, another one for good measure, her striking's on point tonight. Right on point. Oh! It's over now. Unbelievable! I'm not sure she could have drawn it up much better. Just a beautiful strike to end the fight for her opponent, who candidly, may not have even seen that flush shot coming. So this is exactly the way she drew it up. She told us during fight week that she had to find a way to finish this fight, to send a message to the rest of this division. Message sent. And ladies and gentlemen, there she is, the UFC Women's Strawweight Champion. The celebration is on after the knockout win under the bright lights tonight. Ladies and gentlemen.